I built not one, not two, but three amazing lamps. They are super simple to make and require just one electronic component. I designed them on Fusion 360, so let's not waste any time and build them one by one. To print all of these lamps, I used my all new Prusa Core 1. I have been using it for the past month and honestly it's been amazing. The print quality is clean, the speed is impressive and the accuracy makes parts fit perfectly. All the models are finally printed, so let's take them off the build plate. And honestly, just look at that, the print quality is amazing. Everything came out super clean and crisp. These are all the parts we need to assemble the lamp. Now let's talk about the electronics. This is the only electronic component we are using, a simple LED kit. It's very common, super easy to use and I picked it up from AliExpress for under $2. All you have to do is plug the USB cable and that's it, you are good to go. Now that everything is ready, let's assemble the lamp. First of all, install the LED unit into the base. After that, insert the legs one by one and secure them using a little bit of super glue so they stay firmly in place. Finally, add the lampshade and just like that, the lamp is complete. Pretty simple, right? Just look how beautiful this looks, the soft warm light feels really calming and relaxing. It instantly changes the mood of the desk and makes the space feel cozy. Now before we continue, a big shout out to Altium for sponsoring this video. Altium is known for powering some of the most advanced PCB design workflows. If you're a student, Altium offers something incredibly valuable, the Altium Student Lab. It gives you free access to industry level design experiences and a complete PCB learning program that walks you through everything from core concept to practical design fundamentals like layout, routing, manufacturing and supply chain basics. You will work on real world projects, build job ready skills and earn an official core certificate that helps your resume stand out and open doors for the future opportunities. Enroll is completely free, check out the link below and join LTM Student Lab today. Coming back to the video, time for the second lamp. This one has a few more parts and it's a bit more complex than the previous one, mainly because it includes some moving parts. All the prints came out really nice and clean. As you can see, there are quite a few more pieces this time. We are using the same LED kit again, but this time we need to make some modifications. First, open the LED unit, just rotate the top and it comes apart. Then open the on-off switch as well. Next, using a soldering iron, disconnect the wire from the terminal. We want two wires to came out from the center at the back, not from the side. There's already a hole in the center, it's just covered with the tape. Alright, it's done. Now just assemble the LED back again and we are done. We also have to disconnect the wire from the switch for the assembly, I forget to show that part. Now it's time to assemble the lamp, just follow the steps I'm showing in the video, it's pretty straightforward and easy. Alright guys, the lamp turns out really good and honestly it's my favorite out of the three. It has these outer rings or flaps whatever you wanna call them. This lets you control the brightness and also direct the light exactly where you need it. It looks super beautiful on desk and it's actually super functional for everyday use.
It's time for the third and the simplest lamp. This one only needs three 3D printed parts. I have actually built this lamp before but that version was smaller and a bit more complicated. This one I wanted to keep it clean, simple and easy to build. Alright, all the parts turns out really good, so let's assemble it. First, install the LED unit into the base. Then grab the cage and screw it onto the base just like a nut and bolt. After that, insert the lampshade from the top and the lamp is complete. It's honestly that easy, but when you turn it on, it looks absolutely beautiful, it really doesn't feel like something that was this simple to make, right? That's it for this video guys, let me know in the comments which lamp you like the most. All models files are available in the description, so make sure to check them out. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it and comment if you have any suggestions. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one, until then, bye bye.